What will it take to get Albuquerque out of this recession? One group doesn't pretend to have the answers, but they do hope they can start a discussion to lead to solutions. News 13's Catherine Mazone is here with more. Crystal, economically, Albuquerque has a lot of challenges to overcome. Albuquerque Business First hopes to give the city a boost by bringing together community and business leaders in their first Reinventing Our City Summit. The recession didn't hit Albuquerque quite as deeply as it did a lot of major cities in the southwest, but we just have not been able to come out of it. Seven consecutive months of job loss. Economically, Albuquerque is struggling. We've relied so much for so long on the federal government. We have the labs, we have contracting, and I think people thought that would always be the case. Albuquerque Business First Editor-in-Chief Rachel Sam says it's become increasingly clear we need more jobs and new jobs. She says New Mexico has become too reliant on a small number of companies and industries. Factor in other economic development challenges like Albuquerque's isolation from other centers of commerce, issues like education and workforce readiness, and Sam says it puts the Duke City at a disadvantage. So that creates a really weird situation where there's a lot of unemployment and there are even more people who are underemployed. Um, and yet there are uh, businesses where really pretty good jobs, high skilled jobs, and in some cases high pay jobs are going unfilled. But Sam's hopes to turn the tables. Albuquerque Business First is hosting a city summit to bring the business community together to develop a vision for the city's economy. The goal is really to leave that day with a commitment by business leaders to continue that conversation, create that plan for what we want Albuquerque to be and how to get us there in terms of job growth. Sam says in studying other states that have bounced back from recession, they've learned it's a process and one that won't happen overnight. It's why she says the quicker we develop a plan, the quicker we can get on the road to recovery. Some of the panelists scheduled include Mayor R.J. Berry, the president of CNM, and a local real estate developer behind the Windrock Town Center project. Back to you. All right, thanks, Catherine. The summit is set for July 17th at the Crown Plaza Hotel. The public is invited to attend.